Sabat, Portales News Tribune, Roses passed around for Good Neighbor Day. 2015年9月3日Jackie Johnson source, the The Portales News Tribune, N.M. Sabat, Ling Sam Portales residents had the opportunity to spread goodwill throughout the community Wednesday for Good Neighbor Day. Heston's floral and gifts hosted the event, which allowed people to come in from bar m 2 p.m. and dine at five cans of non-perishable food items in exchange for a dozen roses. At bar m there were ting bar stems of roses waiting to make their way through the community. Participants turned in items to be donated to the food pantry at the community services centre in Portales. Then signed a pledge to give one rose and pass the others at stems to people in the community. The event, which Heston's owner Rosalie Richards said is celebrated throughout the U.S. and Canada, kicked off successfully, collecting lock back food items before Zabyet M. that swell over half of what we collected all day last year. So we've had a fabulous turnout, Richards said. Several people look forward to it every year. And the heartwarming stories make us continue to do it. David Essex is one of the people who returns for the event each year. I enjoyed participating, because I think it is a good way to better the community and help out a lot of people, he said. Essex planned on giving the roses to his associates throughout the community, and his first stop was the television station at Eastern New Mexico University. Rena Garrett was the first to receive a rose from Essex, and she said it brightened her day. Cheryl Borden also received a rose from Essex. David has been bringing us roses every year for a long time, Borden said. I always look forward to it, and it always makes my day. Gaynell Thomas, who dropped off her cans in the morning, said she had five friends in mind at the food bank that she would be giving the roses to. I want to give them to these people, because I think through their service of feeding others, they are the best kind of example of good neighbors, she said. Rosie Jimenez stopped by the flower shop with her granddaughter, Janway. Jimenez said she would be giving all of the roses to her daughter, Francine, as a belated birthday present. Andy Mason and Fusion World Dance from Menmu also attended the event to provide entertainment. Richard said there would be a chance to win some prizes for those who brought in five extra cans. In the past, we've had a lot of people bring in extra canned goods, but we had to limit it to one dozen roses, so more people could have a chance to participate, she said. So this year, we've decided to have a drawing for them. The event continues to grow, and we see an increase each year, so we will likely run out, she said. It's probably my favorite day of the year because it just fits our mission of giving back to the community. Copyright. C. Yi Tin Ling The Portales News Tribune. Clavis. N. M. Visit the Portales News Tribune. Clavis. N. M. At www. Distributed by Tribune Content Agency. L. L. C.